Alright, so I gotta put a worm I gotta put a worm on here for you still. Where are the worms? Let's see. Where are they? Right here. I see them. Oh dad, I see one. See the worms? Yeah. Let's Come see. Let me see. There they are. Are you gonna get one? Pull them out. Oh. Pull them out. Ah! Huge. Mom, you've never seen worms that big, have you? Stuck. They're not like they're not like the little ones that we have in the yard. Pull them out. It's, they're stuck. Pull. You gotta pull really hard. Yeah, pull, pull, pull. Oh my goodness! Show me that worm. Come back by that. <laughs> what do you think of that? Uh, he's messy and muggy and dirty. <laughs> Is that the biggest worm you've ever seen? Yes. <laughs> All right. Let's put him on the hook. Hold it down, and then when you throw it, you let go of the button. Okay. Yeah. And then you reel it in until you hear the click. When you see the bobber move, okay. when you see the bobber move, you pull on your. Line, okay? Only only when the bobber oh, moves. Wait, I see it. You've got one. Now pull, pull. Now reel in. Reel in. Oh, Silas, yay! Reel in. Oh, reel oh, it in. Oh, faster, you faster. reel it in. You reel it in. Use all your might. Keep reeling. Keep going. Keep going. Keep reeling. We got a fish. Reel it in. Reel him in. Ah! Woo! You, <laughs> you caught a fish. Look at that, show the camera. Here, let's reel it up a little bit. Ah, look at that fish. Man, we haven't been here for 10 minutes and you caught a fish. So earlier today, Silas told me that he wanted to go fishing every single day. And what's really funny about that is I had already decided to talk about uh, work ethic. And a lot of people are talking about YouTube as a beast. You gotta feed the beast. And there's a lot of people out there that are deciding to feed the beast every single day. So people are talking about feeding the beast every single day. And while that's a lot of work and not necessarily reasonable for everybody, there is a certain amount to be said to working hard, putting in the work and the effort every single day to find success. And feeding the beast is something that needs to be done regularly. And so because I've, because I've decided to try to uh, work towards this goal of 10,000 subscribers in a year, I've realized that I've got to put in more work. And so what that means is regularly vlogging more than once a week. <clears throat> Pro I'm not going to promise every single day because there's just going to be days where I can't. Um, but I'm going to try my best to vlog every day at least two to three times a week minimum because you ha if you wanna achieve success, and this isn't just for YouTube, this is for business, this is for whatever dreams you have, you can't, uh, dreams without action are just dreams, but once you come up with a plan and start taking action, those dreams become goals, and eventually those goals turn into success. And so, you know, that's the formula, that's the, the methodology that 
you know, the success, you know, the people who have found success um, talk about. And so that's what I'm going to put into practice. I'm going to put in the work every day because you can't put in the work and then complain when the success doesn't happen. So I hope that you'll put in the work. Whatever your dream is, put in the work. Work hard, feed the beast, achieve your dreams. All right, so that's my two cents for the day. I gotta pack up this fishing gear. We got, eh, we don't have a lot of stuff, but I gotta pack up this fishing gear and get home and eat dinner. So, all right, thanks for watching. Um, if you like this episode, please hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe so you can see more videos and watch me along my journey to achieve 10,000 subscribers in a year. All right, later. What are you doing? Are you excited? It's so pretty here. It is. It's really pretty here. Mom? What? I can see the book. I can see the mountains through those trees. You can. Yeah. So what else do you see? I see volcanoes through the mountains. Oh, really? Yeah. Volcanoes through the mountains. What see? do you think about fishing? Good. You like it? The lava is coming over here right now. Oh, you are so great at fish stories already, aren't you? How big was the fish that you caught? Okay, yeah. Back up for that. Show me how big he was. Uh -oh. oh, he's an honest fisherman. The truth, yeah. The truth shall set you free. Good boy. <laughs> <laughs>